Without question, late night talk shows have had their controversial moments and ones that we'd perhaps want to forget, but absolutely cannot. So join Facts First to check out some photos from late night talk shows for adult eyes only. Madonna and Johnny Carson On June 9, 1987, Madonna appeared on The Tonight Show with Johnny Carson to discuss her career. While we're used to Madonna being one of the biggest stars of today, you'd have to have lived in the 80s to know just how big of a deal she was. She was at the height of her career, and not only was she loved for her music, but also her beauty, wit, and charm. During the interview, she often made Johnny Carson blush due to her charm and flirtatiousness. He was completely taken with her beauty, and the episode was slightly controversial due to their large age difference. Madonna was also married to actor Sean Penn at the time, and their troubled relationship became the subject of tabloids and brought about controversies of its own. And while we're used to seeing hosts flirt with female guests, it was actually unusual in the 1980s to see a female guest flirt with the host so freely. This episode is still one of the most famous of the show, and fans love watching Madonna flirt and seeing Johnny being at almost a loss for words while she charms him. Adrian Barbeau and Johnny Carson Before Madonna charmed Johnny, Adrian Barbeau sent him reeling in 1974. The episode was filmed December 12, 1974, so naturally discussing Christmas was one of the many things discussed on the show. When Johnny asked her about receiving presents, she made the offhand statement that she would receive lots of presents due to her multiple lovers. While perhaps not a shocking statement today, this was quite a bold statement to make in 1974. Barbeau was a sex symbol, and she was indeed desired by many men. Johnny clearly wasn't interested in what types of presents would be wrapped up, but was interested in exactly who these multiple lovers were. Ever the lady, Adrian didn't name names, much to Johnny's chagrin. Dick Cavett's Chats Of course, the greatest things about late-night talk shows were the chats. Perhaps the master of the intellectual chat format was Dick Cavett, who had a variety of different guests and wasn't afraid to discuss challenging topics. He interviewed actor Marlon Brando, which wouldn't have seemed controversial, but the actor wasn't interested in discussing his career very much. He was mostly interested in discussing activism, particularly the treatment of Native Americans at the time. He discussed the controversy when he refused to accept his Oscar for The Godfather and instead sent Sheen Littlefeller to accept it and to discuss the attacks on Native people. He discussed how he felt about social and political issues in the U.S., and this caused quite a stir at the time. But it wasn't just American guests who Dick Cavett hosted and who riled up audiences. He also interviewed the prominent British politician Enoch Powell. At the time, Powell was expressing his concern about the high levels of immigration to the U.K. from peoples of vastly different cultures and who were from former British colonies. Naturally, this was an uncomfortable topic for many, and one we couldn't imagine being discussed politely on today's late night shows. Dick Cavett was polite to Mr. Powell, though his other guest, Jonathan Winters, challenged Mr. Powell on his views. The interview is arguably one of the highlights of late night talk shows, though certainly for adult eyes and ears only. Drew Barrymore surprises David Letterman. David Letterman will likely never forget the birthday on February 22, 1995, but it wasn't his birthday he was celebrating. Rather, it was Drew Barrymore's. During the interview, which was recorded on her birthday but released two months later, she was very flirtatious with Dave the whole time. She took hold of the reins in the interview and continued to flirt with him again and again, not worrying about their age difference or how uncomfortable and shy he became. In the middle of the interview, music began playing and she jumped up on his desk and started dancing. The dancing itself seemed outrageous for the time, but then all of a sudden she lifted up her t-shirt and exposed her bare breast to Letterman and the cameras managed to catch it. This remains one of the most shocking and perhaps most watched episodes in the history of late night, and one of the reasons why many parents were cautious to let their kids watch late night talk shows. You never knew what was going to happen. Raquel Welch with Dick Cavett If there are photos from the late night talk shows for adult eyes only, then it's from this interview with Raquel Welch. She was known for her performances in films where she often bared parts of her body and showed off her sexiness. She did precisely that in her interview with Dick Cavett, August 2, 1972. She was wearing a dress that showed off her midriff and her long legs. Needless to say, some audience members weren't really paying attention to Dick's questions or her answers. But what was wonderful about this interview was how classy she was. She was sexy without flaunting too much and without being too immodest. This is likely one of the best interviews she ever did, and Dick Cavett was always the professional who knew how to focus on the interview, even faced with a beautiful lady who one couldn't look away from. 
Suskind and Greer. Talk show host David Suskind has a reputation for discussing difficult topics on his own show. When he was a guest on someone else's show, there was no difference. If you look at photos between David Suskind and Jermaine Greer on Dick Cavett's show, they might frighten you, so they're certainly for adult eyes only. This is because Jermaine Greer, the famed feminist, was expressing her views which David Suskind didn't agree with. Overall, however, the interview and debate was rather polite, not what we're used to seeing together. But there was a clash, and perhaps this discussion was a catalyst of the huge culture war debates we'd see decades later. Joan Rivers and Elvira When Johnny Carson wasn't available, he'd have guest hosts on his show. One was Joan Rivers, who wasn't afraid to speak her mind and be provocative. And on one such episode, released in the 1980s, Joan Rivers had the enchanting Elvira as a guest. Elvira was, as expected, dressed in a sexy outfit, and even Joan blushed. Elvira showed off her legs and midriff, and Joan Rivers commented on how amazing Elvira's cleavage was. But Elvira wasn't uncomfortable and managed to laugh it off. This is likely one of the most memorable interviews of The Tonight Show but with many photos for adult size only. Robin Hilton and Johnny Carson Actress Robin Hilton, who had a short-lived career, had one appearance on The Tonight Show with Johnny Carson. She had just appeared in Mel Brooks's Blazing Saddles, and that was the film that made her a star. She was naturally eye-catching and wearing a sexy dress. Johnny was smitten by her and surprised when she said she had never participated in beauty contests, though she did start her career as a model. This was one of her rare interviews and perhaps her only major TV appearance. As a result, it's one of the most memorable interviews of hers and arguably one of the most memorable on The Tonight Show. Johnny Carson loved having beautiful female guests on the show, and this is perhaps one of the few where he seemed taken by a woman's beauty but also managed to keep his composure. Robin was more shy than some of the other actresses who appeared, so Johnny wasn't at a loss for words with this one. Now it's time to hear from you. Did you know about any of these incidents from late-night talk shows? Do you think today's shows have become too watered down? Let us know in the comments section below.